and welcome back. Today's video and dance will be about freedom. And we're so fortunate here in the United States that we have many freedoms, like where we want to live or who we want to love and the kind of job that we want to have. And in the Jewish tradition, we celebrate those freedoms with the holiday of Pesach, or Passover. And for that holiday, we have a very special dinner, and we have a Seder, which means we do it in a specific order. And we tell the story of when we were enslaved and how we became a free people. And it's so important to share this with our children, our grandchildren, and our friends, because it's not only about our freedom, it's about the importance of freedom for everyone. And wouldn't it be a perfect world if everyone felt their freedom and people learn to work together? Okay, so let's warm up. We're gonna start with a little plie, which is just bending our knees, and we'll bounce with it. And you can bring your legs in and bounce, or you can have your legs open and bounce. Great, we're gonna do the releve, and we're gonna bring our hips forward over the balls of our feet and shift to releve. And we're going to do that a few times. We're going to reach with our arms overhead and get a really big stretch and then go into plie. And that is the gesture for freedom. And we make circles with our arms. That's the gesture for the real world, like this. or the other direction, or like this, or like this. And how about some really big circles? And reverse them. Great. Those movements didn't travel. And we're gonna use some gestures in the dance as well. But first, let's do some movements that travel, like walking. And when we walk, we're gonna add a peace sign, and we're gonna put our hand on our heart for love. And let's try that together. Let's take that arm circle around our head, one arm, then the other. And let's add walking in a circle. And now let's add some gestures that we're going to use for this dance. We're going to roll our hands down, and that's going to be the walls coming down. We're going to take our foot on the half toe in the back, because that's going to help, and we're going to add the plie. And then we're going to stretch up for freedom. And you could also add a jump. Great. When we go to the east, we're going to add a little shuffle. And that little sideways slider shuffle looks like this. Do it with me. And we'll add the east, the west, the north, and the south. Let's do that again. The east to the right, west, north, and south. When we say, do you hear me now, we're going to add that little shuffle. Do it with me. Anytime you hear the word real world, make a circle. 
anyone you want. If they say stand your ground, just stand tall. That's perfect. How about your gift? My gift to you would be here. If I wanted to count, I might count this way, or I might count like this. We're going to use our fingers for people. And what if all the people got along? It would be a perfect world. What if all the children had clothes to wear? What if they had a good education? It might look like this. And if they had the right medicine and a good doctor, it would be a perfect world. How about if everyone had a home that they liked with a roof over their head? That would certainly be the perfect world. If they had enough food to eat, they could drink fresh water, and they could trust the air that they're breathing. Now, you can use the gestures I've just showed you, or you can make up your own. Or don't worry, you don't even need to do the gestures. Just listen to the song. And the parts that you can dance with me, come on and dance it with me. The perfect world. Everybody had their freedom All the people learn to live together That would be a perfect world This is real Thank you for dancing the perfect world with me, and I hope that we'll see you again for video three. Bye-bye.